G'day guys, this is Zons here from darkprovance.tk or darkprovance.tumblr.com. Today we're going to be looking at uploading pictures and putting them into your thing. So basically our last episode, we got the CSS sheet and the divs. Just put that in there and delete the rest. So basically this right now will be in the description. Um, so basically it's left and right side. So we want to do a background image and an image that's on the sidebar on the left side. So we're going to start with a meter. So we're going to open with a meter and go opening arrow meter space name equals apostrophe and go image column background and column and then space content equals column one column I mean I mean apostrophe not those columns sorry about that <laughs> um, so basically this is the meta code for the um, background image that will be a thing to upload it so basically we need to put it in the body tag where the body background color is so we write background um, dash image column URL and then we go a bracket and then the curly bracket and then go image column background and basically this will um, like make it so it will change that uploaded image to it so you just end up with a curly bracket and bracket so um, once we save this we'll just refresh this so basically you can see here it's right there and I'm just going to um, upload a picture of myself. I hope this doesn't take this long to like, you know, upload but it's on 17% so it's pretty good. But this will just like make a um, picture and please note this is a very very big large resolution. If not it would, you know, use repeating so would actually have to you know edit all that stuff but we're just putting it in just like you know so just for a tutorial sake so tumblr's taking forever to load this picture but as you can see this is me so <laughs> we just clear that picture and save it again <laughs> so um basically now we want a one that will be like the on the left side as an upload and this is basically what we're doing this little picture of myself here and it will auto size and um, auto width for you so um, we're gonna open this with a meter so we're gonna go opening arrow meter name equals apostrophe image column and then we're gonna go side bar and then apostrophe and then content equals one okay it's always one with this unless it's a color thing so um basically this is um for the sidebar that will add an upload thing and sorry if i'm a bit edgy here i am really tired i've been working so hard at work but um basically we've got the meter there and we take away that left side and go opening arrow a href which, which is referencing a page that once it clicks it will go to that just do a forward slash for there title we won't have anything so just do two apostrophes with no space close that off with the arrow and then go image src is scroll so this is basically the url and we put the curly bracket image column sidebar there and then column and that will basically it will upload and then it will go to there okay so we're going to make this width the same width of our left so we're going to make this 300 pixels okay so um once that's done just end the um the link so opening arrow forward slash a and Basically, you've noticed that the left side's gone, so we're just going to save this and refresh it. 
Um, see, we've got sidebar, so basically we'll upload that. And now it's uploading, so bear with me for a second. Okay, it's at 80%. Very sorry about this as well, so... But, um, we're going to save this and go into our page, and when we refresh it, it's, oh, it's going to take forever again. <laughs> so, um, okay. Um, we're just going to refresh that again to see if it will work. And as you can see, that it's going by 300 pixels. Um, basically, yeah, um, there's not really much to say, but that's how to have an uploader. Um, thank you for watching, guys. Um, please subscribe, like, and everything, and please stay tuned. On Zuz out.